people welcome back to the channel and this in this video guys I'm going to a make make a guide yeah just like a guide how to get um, 25 ways how to get primal gems so so um, I've been reached um, at level 53 at adventure rank and I have a lot of things I've, I've known about this game and how to get primal gems from this game so I wanted to share to you guys uh, this 25 ways how to get primal gems so without further ado let's just start this video so let's start with the first way the first way is going to I'm going to say chests yeah chests you guys of course you guys know what chest is in Thailand so there are a lot of chests and a lot of um, yeah a lot of them like common chests exquisite chests then we have precious chests we have the serious chests so there are a lot of them in Thailand and uh, what you want to do is um, collect every one single, every single one of them because they'll give you instant primal gems for free and it is fast to get and don't underestimate 2 or 5 primal gems that is a lot so next to the second way the second way is going to be daily commissions daily commissions are like a small quest you got every single day you will get four of them so uh, you can see at your adventure handbook over here and you can see the commissions you will get four commissions every day and one commission will give you 10 primal gems and if you have already complete four of them you'll get a bonus of 20 20 free primal gems so a total of 60 a day so that's not bad at all so the next one is going to be unlock teleport waypoints like this. These are teleport waypoints. These are. This is another one. This is another one. So there are a bunch of them in Teyvat. And what you want to do is just unlock one, uh, every single one of them. It will give you instant five or ten primal gems. I forgot. And it is easier for you to uh, teleport. To the, loco the, to the, the locations you want to go so it is easier for you for finishing your uh, missions or what you want to explore yeah just like that and it will give you power gems okay that's for the third one I'm going to be a little bit fast you because there are 25 ways it is it will be a lot okay so the next one is going to be Animoculus and Geoculus what but what are those? Maybe you you guys uh, know what are those? These are. This is one of the statue of the animal archon. So this is for the animal, and in Liyue it's going to be Ge uh, Geo. Yeah. So what you want to do is collect Animoculus and Geoculus, every single one of them in the entire map, and there are a bunch of them, like um, around a hundred, more than a hundred. So it is easy, and you can use the um, map tool by Genshin Impact themselves, an official website of the uh, Genshin Impact map, and you will know where are the locations of every single one of the Animaculus and the Geoculus. You can upgrade the Statue of the Seven like 10 times. Every uh, one level will give you 10 Primal Gems. So another way to get primal gems next one going to be unlocking domain i'm going to open the map once again and these are the domains just by unlocking them you will get five until ten primal gems so that is easy just the same as the teleport waypoint so the next one is also domain but uh, some of them will give you primal gems but not all of them just some of them and it will only give you one chance so if you have already collected them you won't get any primal gems if you repeat the same way and you will never get the second chance so if you have already uh, received the primal gems if you reset or you want to do it again you won't get any primal gems 
that's for the sixth way and now we jumped to the second way is adventure handbook if you are a pc pc user you're gonna um, press f1 and you're gonna open the handbook this handbook will have a um, bunch of chapters i have to reach the chapter 9 and i'll i'll start from the the first chapter the first chapter if you have already uh, finished every single uh, progress or every single quest small quests from the book you will gain 50 primal gems and for the chapter 2 you get another 50 chapter 3 another 50 and for 100 so there are a lot of primal gems you can get by doing these small quests or small uh, tasks for you okay let's just um, continue the eighth one is read guide from our chief so what you want to do is press escape and go to the art chief our chief is like a book like a guide for you that tells you materials equipments living beings around Tevat. so what you want to do is just read read uh, some of them and I don't know I just found this by accident I read some of them and I gain some primal gems Adventure rank reward. Adventure rank reward. When you um, when you reach um, a certain level of adventure rank, some of them will give you like um, free primal gems for yeah for reaching that level. So that is not bad. But not every single one of them. Just some of them, like uh, level ten, if I'm not mistaken, and then level fifteen or level twenty. So yeah, that is. One way to get a primal gem. Next is the code rhythm. So sometimes Genshin Impact will give you a code for rhythm, a a reward. So what you wanna do is just search the code. Sometimes it's when an um, update, an update or a maintenance, they will give you a code. And what you wanna do is just rhythm them, and you'll get primal gems. Like the last one, we we've got like 60 per code. So that is not bad it's very fast to get the next one is mail it is almost same like the code one the code uh, after after you after you um, read in the code you will still get a mail and it will be it will be sent to your mail in game so what you want to do is just check your mail often okay like the last update we get a 600 free primal gems because of maintains and update so check your mail often why because if i'm not mistaken after 30 days if you didn't read that mail it will be gone so like expired so uh, what you want to do is check your mail often okay next for the 12th one this spiral abyss it is right here if you don't know it is musk reef Spiral Abyss will be unlocked for 20, at least 20, 20 adventure rank. So this is like a floor. There will be a bunch of floor, like from first floor until the thir third, if I'm not uh, mistaken. So every floor you will get like nine, uh, nine, nine stars max. So. If you get three stars, you will get a, a bunch of primal gems. Six star, you will get a bunch of primal gems, and nine star, you will get a um, bunch of primal gems. Also, that is for one floor. The second floor, you will get another primal gem. So, for me, Sparrow Abyss is the best way to farm primal gems because it is very fast. Okay, that's for uh, the Sparrow Abyss. Next, we've got Silly. If you don't know what Silly is, Silly is, is like a, a spirit, if you don't know, around Teyvat. A spirit like a uh, blue, blue color spirit and red for dragon spine. And what you want to do is just follow them and they will lead you to their like nest, like their home, their statue. And you will gain uh, three chests. If I'm not mistaken, it is an exquisite chest. For you, um, you can get two until five primal gems per chest and there are a bunch of sillies 
in this in Taiwan. So every time you found one of them, just follow them, really, or mark them in the map, so you you will you will not lose them. Okay, next for the fourteenth is small quests, small quests around the world. I mean Taiwan, yeah, Taiwan is the world in Genshin Impact. There are small quests like lighting, lighting the torch, torch of um, pyro, pyro torch, and then you you know, just small quests. It will give you exquisite chests or even precious chests. So that is another way to get primal gems. Next one is challenge. If you don't know what challenge is, sometimes you'll find like a red colored, um, like. Thing, sing, red thingy, and it is like a sword or an ancient clock, an ancient timer. So what you want to do is just press that uh, that thing, that red thing, and it will be a challenge for you, a time challenge. What you want to do is just beat the time, and you'll get your chests. Like maybe it's exquisite chest or even like serious or or precious chests. Yeah, that's another way to get um, primo gems for free. And the next one is mission. Of course, mission. Like uh, the main mission and the sub mission. Sometimes main missions will get sixty per pot. So what you want to do is just press G on your keyboard, and it will open the missions. But I've already finished every single one of them. So there are no active quests right now. So if you have quests, just press that G button on your keyboard and just finish every single one of them. Sometimes you gain primal gems, but sometimes no. It, it is okay. You you get character, you get an XP experience, and by uh, gaining experience, you can easily level level up your adventure rank. So that's for the mission. Next one, the seventeenth, is world mission. I don't know what's the what's the name, but I give the name by myself. A world mission, just like a little puzzle, a little puzzle that you need to think about to to finish that little small quests, like you know, like a riddle, like a small quests that didn't pops up in the G button. So you need to figure it by yourself. Or by YouTube. There are a lot of tutorials on YouTube, and after you finish that uh, mission, you'll gain more primal primal gems. Okay, that's for the 17th and for the 18th is Shrine K. Shrine K. There are a bunch of them in Mondstadt and Liyue. Uh, let me tell you, in Mondstadt, this thing right here. This symbol, I give it for the shrine key. One of here, one is here. Another one is uh, over here. This one is also. Hey, no, no. This one is for chests. This one over here, and um, yeah, right here. And then for Li Yue, we have over here, over here, over here. So shrine key is like some um a um. Like a small building that you need um, a key to open that building. So what you want to do? How to get those keys? There are a bunch of ways to get keys. There are from missions, or yeah, a lot of them from missions or some domains, and sometimes from this book right here. Yeah, this is the key to open the shrine. Yeah, I don't know what's the name. Just for open the. Building the little building, so this is the key. And for Li Yue, it is yellow. Okay, okay, you can get it from missions. You can get it from domains. So yeah, just bear with it. Okay, next one. We're going to go to achievements. Achievements. You go to escape and open the achievements. Achievements. There are a bunch of them. Like wonders of the world. You have a lot of them. And you'll get primal gems for free, like this. So it is quite easy. Some of them are easy, and some of them are not. Like this, open 400 chests in ones that I haven't. I, I haven't um, finished this achievement, but 
Yeah, that's not bad. Okay. Next to the hangout quests. Hangout quest is a new quest in up a uh, 1.5 update if I'm not mistaken. So what you want to do is just press that G button again and press this story quest maybe. Yeah. Press this and press this uh, book right here. Yes, this is the hangout quest. So you can hang out with these characters and you'll get the prize if you have finished the endings. There are like six endings like right here. I have finished four of them. So look at look at this. You can as you can see you get primal gems by finishing the hangout um, endings. That's for the for the um, hangout quests. So next one is next one is going to be event. So there are a lot of events um, going on Genshin Impact. But for this event is this one. Yeah, Midsummer Island Adventure. This event will give you a lot of primal gems. A lot of them. And easy to get. So there you you will give they'll give you a guide to finish the um to finish the uh, quests and you'll get your primal gems so as you can see this is one of them you'll get 60 60 another 60 60 60 there are a lot of primal gems right there and next sorry next we have the hidden or hidden chests hidden chest from the name you can know that her hidden chest is a chest that is maybe buried around Taivat or you need to talk to an NPC to unlock the quest and you'll and they will lead you to the chest so that's it and I'll make this content I'll make how to get the hidden chest around Taivat in the next content okay so next one is 23rd 23rd is going to be Mondstadt and Liyue Reputation. Mondstadt and Liyue Reputation. I'm going to, um, the, I'm going to go there. Okay, for Liyue, for Liyue, you can find over here, this one right here, this, um. This triangle thing, and for months that you'll find over here, so you can open the map. So I'll lead the way for a uh, Liyue. For Liyue, it's going to be right here. Go down over here, and then yeah, this this blue blue uh, girl right here, Miss Yu. So what you wanna do is not. This one, not bounties, not requests. That's all for the reputation level. But I want to say it's Liyue quests right here. All of them, some of them, not all of them, sorry. Some of them will give you primal gems, okay? Some of them, just some of them. And if I'm not mistaken, one quest will give you like 40, 40 primal gems. So that is not bad at all. And I've forgotten every single one of them. So if you want to know, you can search the title at YouTube and some of them will give you guide how to finish every um, will finish every quest and you will gain your promo gem. So that's not bad at all. So that's for the um, Li Yue and Monster reputation. And next we're going to be Trust Rank Serenatia Pot. Trust Rank Serenatia Pot. Serenatia Pot is a new a new thing at 1.5 so I'll go there you will get this pot over here after you after you finish the quests with Granny, Grandma Ping if I'm not mistaken so let's just enter this Serenatia pot okay after you enter this uh, world right here you're gonna talk to Tabe 
And I'll give you the trust rank over here. Every time um, you every time you reach a new level, you get a promo gem like this. Level one. 60, 260, 60, another 60, 60, 60, until 10. So a total of 600 easy primal gems. Okay, that's for the Serenatia pot trust rank, but that's not it. Okay, for the last one, the 25th, is going to be another Serenatia pot thing. Okay. Okay, this is a new update at 1.6 that you can invite your companion, your favorite companion into your home. Yeah, just like that. So what you want to do is just like this. I'm, I'm going to tell you. You're going to make this, uh, this set over here. This set over here. Let's just say this one. You need this, um, this furniture and after you make them, after you make those and you make this set for example as you can see over here Zhongli Zhongli likes this furnishing set so like this I'm going to go here like this I've put Zhongli over here he likes this place and what you want to do is just talk to him after you talk to him he will give you uh, primal gems for yeah just said just say for rewards so yeah that's it that's it yeah that's all 25 ways to get primal gems um yeah i think that's all for this video thank you guys so so much for watching this video don't forget to subscribe to the channel and turn on the notification bell so you will not miss any new video in the future like this video if you like it share it to your friends especially for genshin impact players just fight and play and you'll get what you what you want like me i played from last year and i got my first five star character this year so i i need to wait like three until four months uh, say three. i played from if i'm not mistaken from september or october last year and i get the first five star is albedo is this january so yeah a couple of months thank you guys so much for watching sorry if i missed something or i said something awful to you guys i'm i'm sorry because yeah yeah you know it's been a while since i used english and i i'm afraid that my english is so broken right now and maybe there's there are some words i said and properly to you guys so that's all for this video hopefully it is important for you hopefully you guys know what you want to do for gaining your primal gems and for spinning or for pulling your favorite character good luck for you guys for spinning clee or you wanna uh, save for kazuha yeah good luck for you guys and good luck at searching or finding your primal gems so Thanks guys very much for watching, sorry for the long talk, and yeah, see you guys in the next video. Peace.